Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your own girl, Bukola. See me, Nikon Bukola. If you are new year, you are welcome. And to the other subscribers, ah, it's a good one. If you are seeing this channel for the first time, please and please don't forget to subscribe. So today I want to show you around my new place and I know a lot of people have been every video I post hey somebody will say how far your new house show us your new house okay I'm going to show you my new house so let's see you oh, welcome this is our humble abode and <laughs> see see my baby boys they are all available they are all at home today so we are doing the videos together so this is the mm, the parlor this is our parlor this is the chair, the dining. It's, it's actually not too big, not too small. It's a medium size for a family of four. And uh, it's quite, <laughs> so it's quite good for its own. So this is, this is it. And if you can remember in the whole house, I had a small chair, but I had to get a new one in this place. I had to get a new chair, but not like a new one. I also got it on Facebook Market. So immediately you are coming in, you are coming in to the kitchen. This is the kitchen. I used to like a big kitchen and I was so happy seeing this big kitchen as in I love it. But this house is, um, we got it for 550 pounds. It's an unfurnished apartment, which means that nothing comes with the house. Nothing. The freezer, we got it ourselves. The washing machine, we got it ourselves. Only the cook is found here. So, if you remember my whole video, you remember this by pot. <laughs> See, this by pot is now working. No, it's not working yet. So, I could use this. In fact, I just finished cooking one badass jollof rice. <laughs> and, hey, let me give you a gist. We got this freezer on Facebook. It's on Facebook Market. Then the person actually has a warehouse where they sell fridge. And this freezer, guess how much? Twenty pounds. <laughs> Twenty pounds. And you can remember this one. So I love, I love the cabinet. The kitchen cabinet is so nice. I love it. And I just like this new house. And um, this this leads us to the upstairs. This from the kitchen you move to the upstairs. From the kitchen you move to the upstairs, and this stairs, you know, if you want to reduce weights, this is the place to reduce weight. Says I'm panting because I climbed up. I'm already panting. <laughs> All of you that want me to do by force, don't worry. I have exercise in my house. You see this stairs? <laughs> it's exercise on this. This is the master's bedroom, and um, it's a big one there is enough space at least to some extent and you can really see downstairs from here you can see downstairs and see the other surroundings it's a sunny day today so. and it's it's an empty house unfurnished so with all this was from our former building the one I staying before then that's it so if you can remember in the video i made concerning my former house in that house the bed is not this type it's not this type when we got here <laughs> those beds could not enter they could not enter into this place that's another dilemma so we have to buy new things again because the old beds were no entry so any house you are renting make sure that everything <laughs> everything can pass through <laughs> because if not or you're low wow you're your own then this is the children's room this is smaller than the other one this is the children's room uh, you can see sony outside yeah if i pull up the curtain yeah uh, it's sunny it's really sunny outside and yeah it's a moderate one for the children and you see uncle people is already looking for me 
Mommy is making video. Everybody is making video today. So this is the two bedroom. Upstairs is having the upstairs is having the rooms. Why downstairs have the toilet, the bedroom, and the kitchen? Let's go downstairs. So okay, I'm, I'm going to show you. The, I will show me up. So I'm going to show you the the toilet. This this is the toilet. The way the house is like a modern, a, it's not modern, it's an let's say an old house for the British old house. That's is how their house used to be. Um, in British, I'll be in Britain then. I must have you, Ibo. In Britain, their house used to be like this where the kitchen, the parlor is always downstairs, while the toilet is also downstairs. So Remember I said in that video, the whole video that I'm thinking of how I'll be coming downstairs to we in the night <laughs> with the children. No. We are still <laughs> having that issues, but we don't have choice. So we get used to it and maybe from 7, 8, we stop drinking too much water so that we won't be going too much to the toilet. <laughs> the toilet. This is the toilet. But beside the toilet, there's a wardrobe. This wardrobe eh, is a lifesaver because I have to keep most of the children's stuff in this wardrobe and my stuff because I don't want to go upstairs after bathing for them. We'll just clean them up and do everything. Everything, yeah. So I think... I think that is the way the structure of the house is. I think then, because of cold, I think too, they don't, they do everything downstairs. They only go and sleep upstairs. So this is how the toilet looks like. Okay, it's a water bath. It's a water bath. Then there is curtain. When you are bathing, you can actually close if you don't want strangers to come in. I mean, no strangers. Eh? And this is the toilet. Then there's a place to keep my things. Then <laughs> this is the olden days light stuff. You put it on from here. And yada. You know it off. If I want to off it, I also off it from here. <laughs> That's the olden days stuff. So it's actually it's not as sush as my former house. That one is sush. But this one is water bath. But the children love this water bath compared to the old house the old house was just shower this also has shower and there's water but where you can as you just rest your muzzle put water and rest your muzzle inside the hot water <laughs> so this is how the toilet looks like then we also have a backyard so this backyard is just for spreading clothes yeah put this it's for spreading clothes it's minute but it's a little bit small just to spread our clothes and just a small backyard and so is a whole the whole house is to yourself but, and that is just the little gist about the house no big deal just a small one but it's not as touch as the old one you too can see but this one is um the old house to yourself everything to yourself but in nigeria it's called duplex they call it house here the duplex here does not have toilet upstairs so part of england used to have toilet upstairs that is the modernized one but these ones are old houses some of these houses are even 50 years old 100 years old but because they 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 know how to take care of their own structures here yeah. so that is why we still find them still very okay so Divine, you want to show a shoe? You will show in this video because you will allow a shoe. You shall have a one. So, thank you for watching to this end. Um, I know somebody else will still ask me how much did you rent this place? It's £550 per month. £550 per month. <laughs> and you might be looking at ah, that much. That money is much in error. Yes, but when you get here, if you are married and you are your husband is coming with you both of you will be working and your husband can work full time you will definitely make the money to pay for house rent house rent is monthly year not yearly like nigeria but just see it as um as your first year that might have some ups and down but definitely things will be better and if you are trusting god to bring you down here just just start i did a whatsapp 
um, I did a, I did a video on my status on WhatsApp recently, and I just said, just start, start with whatever you have. Many of us did not have any money that we saved somewhere for this journey. We just started. So, just start. Get international passport. That's still the, the least thing you can get. Get those international passport. Because Nigeria know they get passport. People are the always finish. <laughs> People are the always finish. So, get the passport. <laughs> For God to set to everything, and for the new ones that are still coming, I will be expecting you guys. Do Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. So let me answer, baby divine. See ya guys. Bye later.